Hello everyone, Carson here, and in today's video, I'm going to be taking you through six things you need to know before you are choosing a web hosting company, before you pick one out. So I'm going to go ahead and run you through those things right now. We're going to get right into it, but before we do, if you want to check out my picks for the top website hosting companies of 2021, because I've used all of these methods and more advanced methods, tested them all, and picked the top ones for you, go ahead and check out my link to that in the description. And now let's get right into the video. Now the first thing you need to be asking is which and how many content management systems or CMS are supported on your website hosting platform. Because CMSs, if you do want to play around with any of the other ones aside from WordPress, you need to know if your platform offers those. So it's always a benefit when a hosting company offers more than just one CMS. And you can usually find that out pretty easily by just going to the website of the web host in question, and they should have that information readily available. The next thing you need keep in mind is how much customization you get. Are there a ton of different features and add-ons that they offer or is it just a basic set web hosting with really no extra features and nothing on top? Because modern web hosting companies, the top of the line ones like HostGator or Bluehost, they offer tons and tons of features on top of their basic web hosting which is just really awesome. For example, HostGator cPanel offers a file manager and FTP access to the back end of your website, which is just really cool, and it's nice to have these extra features when you are working on a website. Next up, and this is a really quick one, but you need to understand the uptime agreement. You need to be looking for at least 99.9% .9 uptime on any web hosting company you go for, or otherwise I just wouldn't go with them. You also need to look at the level of support from these companies. If they don't offer good support, if they don't offer support that's helpful and knowledgeable, you don't want to go for the company because odds are you will need support eventually and when you do, you're going to be looking for good support. Next, you need to know the available plans because all the different website hosting companies specialize on different plans with different resource requirements for their websites. So if your website is a small blog, maybe you would go with Hostinger, but if it's slightly bigger, you might go with somewhere like HostGator. You get the idea though, you need to run through the plans and make sure the website hosting company has the plans for you and that your website requires. And finally, the last thing you need to know is you just need to know the security and how protected you are. Ideally, you want a good website host to provide automatic updates and things like that, just security updates and general breach protection for your website so you don't get into any trouble and end up having your website hacked. But those are the six things you do need to know when you are looking for a website host. And as I've said, I've already run through all these questions and more and established what I think the top website hosts for 2021 are. So if you want to check those out, go ahead and head down to my link in the description. Thanks for watching. Remember to leave a like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, and I'll see you in the next video.